Right, water in a kettle and turn it on. Ooh, kettle, you are so sexy. Ooh. Yeah, I turned it on. Monday the 6th of July. Not long. My birthday soon. Not telling you when. I'm going to have to sort the seat that I expect. Okay, to today it's behaving itself. It does this, it'll go a week, 10 days. Not a problem, works perfectly. And then all of a sudden, for no apparent reason, it just decides to be a little pig and not behave. Right, we're off to Tether Farm to the barn site because the electricians are there finishing up their bits and bobs. Um, I need to go over there so I can be trained how the security system works because there's buttons and key fobs and thingies that I don't know where, where they go. I've got me thingy, I just don't know. I'm sure I'll work it out, but they're going to show me how it all works and hopefully apparently we can have the CCTV cameras there they reckon that they can get it straight to my house here and then via to my phone so that'd be handy because then I could look on my phone whoever's about we'll see anyway we're probably over there again tomorrow because we've got to do a bit of work on the hedge I've got some stumps to come out for a, a, a widening a gateway and some other bits also you'll see a bit of the build today probably not a lot because i'm not going to go through with you lot the security because that would be stupid but uh maybe some chainsaw and digger work tomorrow ready nothing right let's go well we're here um electricians have disappeared it appears we're halfway through putting up the, um, I don't know, is it a microwave sender or a Wi-Fi thing? Apparently, apparently that thing can send a signal up to 10 miles. I don't know. It's all black magic to me. So. But pretty much everything is done now, apart from actually putting the door on. Um, they can't finish electrics until the door is actually put on because there's too much stuff that folks would pinch other way, so... I think the lights are safe, though. I don't think you're getting up there. Anyway, the wheat isn't looking too bad. So, uh, this bit here obviously never got sprayed because the flag leaf is in the... Well, not very good. But if I wander down a bit further, I'm kind of open that as we get further out we did have a bit of drought stress earlier in the year but out here where the sprayer has been flag leaf is kind of okay a few spots we'll allow it a few spots <laughs> Where's rabbits? Where's rabbits? Where's rabbits? Where's rabbits? Where's rabbits? Where's rabbits? Rabbits? Where's rabbits? Where's rabbits? Go on, rabbits! Rabbits! Go on! Come on! <laughs> you only went ass over tip, didn't you? Rabbits! Where's rabbits? Rabbits! Yeah, don't let me catch anybody else's dog doing that. Come on, Go 
Come on. Come on. Come on. Right, well the sparks are obviously not here. Uh, they can't be far away because the gate's open and they're the cherry picker here. So I presume they've gone to get something. So I'm over here, I might as well do something useful. Um, I can save myself a trip over this afternoon. I'll go and check the sheep now. Now it was commented on on my previous video where Abby and I came over to care of the sheep. The grass is too long for sheep. Grass is too long for any grazing animal. None of them will enjoy this. But the fact of the matter is we didn't mow this piece of ground because of the long wet spell we had, then the long dry spell we had, and then having to keep the cattle at home and at all our grazing plans for this year were basically torn up and thrown away. So because when we did the mowing over here, we were still in a long dry period, we decided not to cut this for two reasons. Word is very up and down, lots of trees and rods and sods, and difficult to make hay out here anyway. And two, we didn't want to cut everything and have nothing for the stock to eat. So, no, it's not perfect. Um, far from it, but the sheep are gradually eating the bottom out of it. Thirty-four. She's gonna have a go at you. She's gonna have a go at you, Biscuit. Watch your back. <laughs> okay. Um, that's enough of that. So all the sheep are here. Um, number eleven um, is right in the middle of the group over there. You can't actually see him. He's a bit hidden for a minute. But he's with his mother and sibling. That's him on the left there. Um, he's still not brilliant, but actually he has filled out a bit. His hips aren't sticking out so much. He seems seems quite happy, and he's not chasing me for a bottle anymore, which is a good thing. So I reckon he stands a good chance of actually making it through this. It was touch and go for a while, but I reckon he'd be okay. Yeah, but that's the towel yeah. I'm going to wipe my face in, and your bum's on it. Good match there. Yeah. Good match there. Oh, you just dropped socks. It's been a very, very long day today. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know there are times I really dislike you, Mr. P. <laughs> oh, there's one that wanted me to say something. There. Oh, there's I was halfway through my piece to camera then. Okay. I'm a carrier. I'm knackered. Someone sent me an email for you. No, for who? Man, we don't make look. Your dad's got his star and roll. Let him carry on. Oh, yeah. He's a thespian, don't you know? Thespian? Oh, I'm not quite sure. <laughs> oh, I've always been a lesbian. <laughs> Are we going to open this cake yes, box or you what? Go for it. Right, just wind it back a bit. Oh. It's been a long day. But fortunately, some nice person has sent me cake. I'm so funny you open that, so like... Well, I've already actually opened it. In fact, I had to close it again you because know, your mother was going to have, have some of the cake out of it. So, you could have had some cake out of it. So, um, a subscriber who has sent us stuff before, thank you very much indeed. What does that look like to you? An A. Okay, it's just me then. No, I was going to say something else. Looks like a looks like someone's drawn. I don't think I didn't want to say rude, it. A rude picture, but it does look like a doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. <laughs> yes, one of those. Oh, itchy eyes. Right, so we've been sent some cake. Cake, 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 cake. cake Card. Yeah. Um, a thingy for, of more cakes. No, that's what they are. Napkins. Okay. So, uh, and this is quite intriguing because, believe it or not, we were only talking about this the other day that Holly could do something like this. Pull the front down here. Oh, pull the front thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of us has already been in this box, haven't we, Julie? Yeah. Yes. So yeah. in here we have got 
Coffee, Listening. that's mine. Yep, yeah, you go for it. Then. Lemon, that's mine as well. Oh, Sam can have the lemon. Emma can have the red velvet. Victoria, that's Victoria. mine. And a red and, and a red velvet that someone else can have. Emma likes red velvet. Emma you see, what is red velvet? It's a chocolate tea. A who what? Chocolate tea. What is it? What's is it? the second egg? And the other one we've got carrot. Someone else can have the carrot. The carrot cake's good. You got two coffee. Another coffee. Chocolate and chocolate orange. Oh. It must be different on the chocolate. So I like all. I like all of those and those two. What's that one there? Carrot and um, and red nice. velvet. You like carrot cake? You will like carrot yeah, cake. Like I might not like carrot cake. He's okay, giving I'll, me a I'll, weapon. I might like <laughs> carrot cake a bit, but <laughs> that's um, that's actually a really nice little present. Yeah, so. it is. That is really sweet. So Mrs. P's already opened this envelope because she was being, but I haven't read it yet. Cup of cake. So it says it says thanks. For what? Luckily, it's in really big print, so I can read it without my glasses. Get it. Get off, I can do it. No. Just a little sweet treat for you here and family for all the hard work, time and dedication <laughs> and for keeping myself and the Ingram family sane during this crazy time. Hope you all enjoy Love the Ingram family. I am going to enjoy all of these. Sam, there's lemon cake! And no, shut up! <laughs> And chocolate. Oi. Abby, if you're watching this, there's a coffee cake. No, here. it's not, because I'm going to eat it now. Which one's the coffee cake? That one there. That's mine. So's that. Are we getting a cup of tea? That I can have with my cake. Well, you can at least try some on the steady camera then. I can what? Try some. I am. I'm going to. The camera's still on. I'm just going to. I'm just going to. Um... Taste test on the camera. Oh, that's intriguing. Which one you want for? Coffee. Mm -hmm. Abby. Don't, don't call Abby. We not answer. Hello? Oh, bugger. We have nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. There's cake at the farm. Nothing to Dad see here. sent cake. Coffee cake. No, I didn't. I've eaten all the coffee cake. Sorry, that load of stuff. Come grab it or it goes to the tent. No. There's also a load of stuff here for you. Abby's far too busy but to come anywhere near. There's a load of little cakes. That's mm. a long cake. So dad's eating all the coffee cakes we get. There's carrot cake. Yeah, there's two. You can have the carrot cake. <laughs> but there's carrot cake. chocolate, lemon, coffee, Victoria. Oh, no. Punch him in the face for eating all the coffee. What? You what? Do you feel better? What did you say? I said punch him in the face for eating all the coffee. I haven't eaten all the coffee. There's another one there. Is it, what's it like? Yeah. I what's it like? Yeah, what's it like? It's nice. There you go. Yeah, so I've eaten one of the coffee cakes, and before you get here, I'm going to eat the second one too. You No, you can't have that. That's my. Have I not even come tonight? Just got a knife. That's my. That's my Victoria sponge. It's got my name on that one. Look. Cocktail. Sorry. <laughs> Well, if you were, that they did. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I've gone. Oh, sorry. 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 Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just going. Oh, dear. That's very kind of you to open my sponge cake for me. You don't care, you'll still eat it. You probably would, actually. <laughs> I just got on a bite. Hmm. There's in two halves. That's very nice. Comes in a little box like that. It's nice, yeah, actually. Are you going to get one? Yeah. <laughs> like that. Yeah. <laughs> right, right, right. Yep. One of them. What do you want? What do you mean what I want? You know what I want. Yes, yeah, that. No. But which cake do you want? Oh, I've eaten that one. This one doesn't actually exist. Give it back. <laughs> no, I want, you know me, I like coffee cake. I've got it. I've got it. Thanks, Holly. Yeah, but I like coffee cake more than you do, therefore it's mine. You had a whole coffee and cake to yourself. And I was the only person mentioned by name. 
Just because it said Ian and Family. Just because it said what? Ian and Family. Yeah, but mostly me. Because it's cake. So, but let, let's just say she's not she's not rushing to get here, is she? Right. It's half past seven, and now we're going to try and do the job that I've been trying to do all afternoon. Trying to. Right then, get your bed. I suppose the one thing we're doing it now is maybe a bit cooler. This kind of goes against the grain a little bit. Mowing grass that my stock could be eating, but right now we've actually got um, plenty of grass so um, I don't know plenty of clover too it looks a bit right Tuesday 7th of the 7th and I'm stuck here for an hour or two because I've got to go to the tip which doesn't open until 9 o'clock so I'm about to do something useful while I'm waiting machine's already on it's a bit tight in here
Very nice Scotch caravan. Abby never forgive me. been clipped on there still managed to pick up some dirt we don't want dirt in the brakes that grain is hard. Not just a bit hard, even the nine inch bucket on the deuce and I was struggling to get down in the grain with that. So uh, I'm pretty sure the guys were very pleased that I'm over here with the digger and they haven't got to dig four post holes by hand. Only got to fill them back in by hand. be interesting. Hopefully they go up that slope. I think we'll just deploy a little bit of low box. Good enough to get them unloaded. Let's see how we get on. <sighs> oh, right, I didn't take the logs up. Okay, so I've got to fetch these stumps out of here, and that ditch has got to be filled in. Hmm.
Stone. Yep, here comes the boss. That means you can't get away from it, eh? <laughs>